Alright, welcome back. This is M-Dog, and we are just giving you a quick update on the spot 71100. And if you've watched uh, the videos in the last few weeks, this has been a really nice eyed spot. And then it went really dry uh, to the point where you just would kind of catch freshwater crayfish and river mussels and nothing else was here. Well, all of a sudden the eyed are back. So just wanted to let you know that we're kind of doing the same thing we were before. Size 6 hooks, 9.8 fluorocarbon line, tuna 16, halibut and salmon 14. The foilies are all working. Now, I will tell you this, the catfish are in the water. You will occasionally get a catfish, but the way I've minimized my vulnerability to catfish is don't keep the boilies on during the day. At night, the eyed seem to get them pretty quick. And so you don't end up with too many catfish at night. But by 8 or 9 in the morning, switch those boilies over to something else. Still doing some testing to figure out what's going to be best during the day. Um, not a lot of bream in the water right now, unfortunately. We haven't had a good bream spot in a while, at least that I'm aware of. Uh, but it is nice to have the eyed back. Last night when we were fishing, streaming online, we caught a couple of eyed trophies on, on both of my accounts. So they are definitely around again. It's not just the one to two kilo eyes. You can occasionally bump into the big ones as well. So this is, a, once again, a nice spot. If you're looking for some decent, steady silver for feeder fishing at Wolkov, 71100 is a, a good place to do it. Um, Let's see what size this one is. This is probably north of three kilos, I would say. Um, it's a pretty decent one. Every once in a while you get like a surprise 3.5 trophy that doesn't quite feel like a trophy. That could be one of these. No, that one's right at three kilo. That's, what it, that's more what it felt like. So I'm going about 70% out casting straight south with some variation. Sometimes a little far, farther, sometimes a little shorter, sometimes a little bit east or west but mostly straight south towards that bridge you see in the distance that one you just saw me pull in was off tuna that middle line is our halibut line and this is the salmon 14 line so we're going to make this a short video but i will at least let you see one more fish come out of the water it's 4:45 in the morning and so i would say you know i'll keep them in until about eight and then i'm going to switch it over to something else if i figure out a, a what, I, what seems like the most efficient bait to have on during the day, I'll, I'll definitely update with a new video or update the text of this video. Um, but mostly what, what you're seeing are things like chub and just kind of other random stuff during the day. But as you can see, overnight the eyed are very consistent biting on these baits. And if you're patient, you'll get some trophies as well. Uh, so as always, thanks for watching and uh, it's exciting news that we can Come back to 71100 and catch some nice eye. There's definitely been some other spots as well. We've tried a ton of spots in the last week or so. Other ones have been good, but right now this seems to be the king spot once again, at least that I've found. Okay, thanks for watching.